When I came on board, I was tasked by Jay Corey of coming up with a food service vocational track that was more management oriented and not as culinary oriented in that we wanted people to learn how to become uh, food service managers as opposed to being chefs. I take a lot of pride for all the clients that are going through the vocational program. They gain a lot of uh, work experience and knowledge to use outside, but for the most part they're using it in here and when they are able to apply it in here in the community, they're helping the community get back out. I've been in the kitchen since I've, since I've been here. I began in the dish room and kind of worked my way up. I was still um, in foundations when I asked if I could be in serve safe. <laughs> I passed my first serve safe test. I'm on my third course of serve safe. Serve safe is going to give you everything that you need to know about food safety. This is required by Maricopa County when you're going into a position as a manager in a restaurant. You'll eventually have to get certified in this. From there, they're going to go into a course which essentially is going to teach them everything they need to know about managing food and beverage as far as different overhead costs, labor costs, food costs, and things like that. We're going to round the, the uh, vocational track up with a four-week um, class on customer service. And this is going to teach you basically everything that you need to know about being customer service oriented and developing policies and procedures on how you want your employees to treat your guests as they come in the building. To apply the knowledge that they learned in the class, they'll work off the recipes and I'll have them meet the standards that I have. A certain way I want maybe the chicken to be cooked or a certain way the pasta should be cooked. There's a standard in all of that. There's a quality standard that they have to meet. I never saw myself this way. I never saw myself as a leader or as someone that people look up to. And I think about like my future, just about how, how uh, different my future is going to be. Through networking with various companies that I've worked with over the years, we're able to get the ladies jobs and uh, they're proving to, to do a great job with it. And now they're actually, I have a, a quite extensive waiting list on people that are waiting for ladies, so we can't produce them as quick as they're being needed right now. Yes, it's just wonderful that um, that I'm learning so much and that I'm, I'm you know in the process of starting my future.